Welcome back to Horizon 4 this time. Today, I just unlocked this. And today, we will uh, probably do a drift build on it. With a lot of power. <laughs> this thing apparently has a crazy 1000 horsepower 7.2 liter V8. Um, I kind of wonder if that's the engine in, in other RTR cars, but I'm not sure. Oh my god. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna like check both. Um, normal, I'm guessing, and then take off the wing, which I'm not gonna do. 335s, well, never know what the amount of power you get, so. I'm gonna stick with the sport tires. Definitely need to upgrade this. Currently, this has, well, it had a stock Coyote engine, but now, uh, well, that had um, kind of my power. I think it was 460, which is stock. Uh, yeah. So 1876 versus 1876, uh, 1382. So, um,. They both make the same power, I'm guessing. Yes, but this doesn't have lag. <laughs> I'm gonna go with that. <laughs> uh, yeah, 1800 horsepower. Almost 1900. We're gonna put 345s on this thing. Uh, no joke. We're not joking. Under 3,000 pounds. It's kind of kind of crazy. This does have the 10 speed. Which means there's a gear for every opportunity ever. I can do something like that. 270 miles an hour. Okay, that's some trouble. <laughs> that definitely needs to stiffen this up a bit. And uh, stiffen that. Lower that bit. Hopefully it won't struggle for grip with B45s, but... 1900 horsepower will most likely destroy these tires. How much? Okay, disappointing. A disappointing amount of angle. I can't even see how much boost we're running. 29.4. I feel like I'm lagging just by the sheer power of this car. Drifting in ninth gear. Oh my god, this thing has too much power. And not enough angle. Well, if this is the engine in Vaughn and Chelsea's car, and if we're able to get 1900 horsepower almost out of those two, uh, or those as well, um, that means 
the Viper might have uh, might have some company on the leaderboards. If you're if you're able to put three forty fives or three fifty fives maybe. Yeah, I think it was three fifty fives. And uh, if those actually have a good amount of angle. I think the Viper might actually have some trouble when it comes to uh, being the king of the leaderboards. But, yeah. Uh, speaking about leaderboards uh we won't reach any leaderboards with the amount of, with the gearing this thing has right now so maybe but this thing <laughs> it belongs on fortune island <laughs> <laughs> yes, I will travel to Fortune Island. But 18, well, 1879-ish horsepower, like, like, that's crazy. That's, that's a lot. <laughs> I understand why this thing is so good at drag racing. Put drag, drag slicks and... An all-wheel drive on this thing, and this thing is is fast. Also, the transmission shifts fast. Yeah, this thing would be a killer. This thing would be a killer. Back on. That's yeah, you couldn't go through that. So I haven't drifted in this game for like a month. It feels like a month. It's probably like two or three weeks. At least not on Fortune Island. Well, this thing is lacking in steering angle. I'm probably like one of the few that actually criticizes just some suspension. Maybe because I guess I've been spoiled in motorsport. Where the suspension actually gives you a good amount of staying angle. There's so many gears, I can't choose. It would probably be better to have like... Two to like... Well, second gear through fourth or fifth to be like really long. See that? You have arrived at your destination. That's far from good. That's far from a good run. I'll be disappointed if this is actually the way 
the RTR car is sound. I would actually be disappointed. <laughs> um, stretch second, stretch third. Okay, bit less stretch. And then start to taper off. Uh, yeah, this thing. Hmm. Kind of struggling, actually. Might actually want to put the three forty fives on. See that? The car like gets. The car doesn't like being close to max angle. It really doesn't. Stare. Yeah, tune is probably horrible. I'm guessing other tuners are all there. But if the car feel like it has no grip sometimes, it's weird. You have arrived at your destination. It also doesn't respond to anything. That's also a problem. Um hmm. <laughs> Yeah, this car is weird. Let's do a conventional setup for me, which would be something like this. See if that makes it better. <laughs> I'm really doubting it. I'm really doubting that. Okay. I think I just introduced a lot of overs there. Also, the car likes stalling. You 
You have to be on the throttle or else the cart actually stalls. Come on! Oh my god. You have arrived at your destination. Yeah. About the car. Sucks. Okay, it doesn't, but I just I'm struggling a lot with this. <laughs> uh, yeah, I actually don't know what to do with it. I feel like nothing I do makes the car actually handle the way I want it to. Turn around when it is safe to do so. Like, it felt better for most of the run, but at the end there, it really was a handful. It still is. The car just, like, it does not like to be an angle. At least, high angle. That, I think, comes down to the lack of steering angle. It's like, it feels good at really high speeds. But when you go like 30, 40, it's... It really doesn't enjoy itself. destination. I think it feels good when you're at full throttle through a long corner. pretty good because I get to stay sorrowful for all
this car at least won't challenge the white car. It doesn't, it, it lacks the steering angle that the white car has. Or really any of the FD cars. They're kind of broken when it comes to steering angle. Like, this feels okay, but... It's not a Viper, <laughs> that's for sure. Uh, this is not a Viper. But, next week... Oh my god. Uh, we're actually getting... Uh, Vaughn's car and Chelsea's car. Hopefully, they handle way better. Also, hopefully, they get the same engine, which maybe I think they do, I think it is, I'm not sure, but I really hope they get this engine, but yeah, because it's 1900 horsepower essentially, like that's amazing, uh, hopefully you can put some really wide tires on them, and uh, the steering angle, and the overall setup of the, those cars hopefully that fixes the issues that at least i have with this car so yeah thanks for watching like and subscribe also it never gets bad to be no fun where i upload and yeah uh see you guys next time in horizon 4 probably with the actual rtr cars so goodbye